Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to compare results with SCADA data. The hasted solution for hydraulic modeling have a, a tool called SCADA Connect. This is an amazing tool where you can use it to easily compare field data with different uh, from different data sources to compare with uh, uh, results from your hydraulic model such as pipe results like flow, uh, hydraulic grade, or tank level, valve data, and etc. So you can easily compare in using graphs or tables both both data. Well, here I have an example. I am using water gems, but this is a very very similar procedure. There, there, where you can where you can repeat it using hammer, hammer, or other hasted product. So I'm going to access the SCADA Connect tool on the Tools menu. SCADA Connect tool. I am using here the SCADA Connect simulator. It's a tool only available on Water Gems. If you go if you go on Zero Gems or Hammer, for example, you're going to find a tool called SCADA Connect. But in, the, in a very similar, you're going to have a configure, a configure icon where you can create or see your SCADA signals. So in this window, you can create and manage your connection with different kind of data sources. So in this case, I have a, a, a data source already set up with one signal for pressure. So in this data source, if I click Edit Data Source, I can see that I have a connection with a Excel sheet. But if you have other kind of source data sources, you can connect with using detect source or RPC source or you have also other option like the ODBC connection or connection with SQL server or Oracle connection so you have several options to connect your hydraulic model to the field data results so if I check my existing SCADA data here I can see I have a historical pressure data from element so I can see the historical time and also for each time the the related pressure results in this case I have only one signal but I I, I, I am able to have uh, uh, several other signals Okay, this is the first step. Now I will add this this SCADA data on my hydraulic model. Okay, let's close this window. Back to the model. I have on the elements toolbar, I have an, a special element only for SCADA data. This element is called SCADA element. This is a very, very simple element to use it's not a network element it's an element that you need to to select where is the element that is connected to the scaled element so if you use the properties window you can see on the attributes element called uh, attribute a field called L, a model element so if you select directly from the drawing you can select the element that's going to be the target to, for the comparison select the junction automatically water gems are going to show you four types of hydraulic results that you can compare so you have the water quality data concentration demand hydraulic grade and pressure selecting pressure automatically the field model element value is going to to show the the results of the water model uh, accordingly to the 
to the time. For example, in this case, I'm using an EPS, an extended period simulation scenario. If I open the time browser, the time browser is going to show me exactly the results of this time. So I'm using, I'm reviewing the results of the 7 a.m. So if I go to the beginning of my simulation, we're going to see the related results. Okay, now we're going to select the signal from the data source that we need to compare. So we have only one. In this case, I have a historical signal. So in, in this list, I have the only one option. It's very simple. So now selecting the signal, I have both results the model results and the scalar results and a difference and similar when you have an element on our gems we can graph results from the scalar element so if you select the scalar element and right click you have the graph option select the graph option we have automatically uh, uh, option to compare on the SCADA on the SCADA group the historical signal and the models the model results clicking OK I have the graph comparing the hydraulic model results to the SCADA data it's very simple hope it helps thanks for your attention